Resident Evil. Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Blindly Play Resident Evil Code Veronica with me, Oxfu. Almost forgot what it was called. And first of all, we've got a steering wheel that I forgot to pick up last episode. And more importantly, we got a couple of gold Lugers. Oh yeah. Too bad we can't use them. <laughs> oh boy. Um. Okay. Wasn't expecting that. Uh, let's put those. Can we put those back? No, wait, wait, wait. Put them back. Put them back. Okay, so we need to take the gold Lugers, but we need to put something in their place and come back out, so I guess we need to take the, uh, those pistols we got earlier and put them in their place, sort of like the wrecked shotgun from Metal, or from, uh, Resident Evil 1. Uh... One second, I gotta collect my thoughts here, because I have no idea what I'm gonna do with that zombie yet. <laughs> okay, let's get out a pistol first. Don't know why I didn't bring those other pistols with me, but... But they're not shaped like Lugers. So, do we have to do something? No, 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 this guy. Three, four, five. Good, he's down. Might as well take them out, actually, while we're at it. But those pistols aren't shaped like, uh, Lugers, so... Guess we have to use... Something else. Now, let's draw this guy down. I'm trying to save as much ammo as I can, because, I mean, to do otherwise would be pretty foolish. Like, you know, getting caught by a zombie when he's moving half a meter per hour. <sighs> I might as well take this guy out now. Because I have a feeling we're going to be back here. You know, just a funny feeling. That we're going to be, like I said, replacing the gold Lugers with another kind. What the heck happened there? What the heck happened there? Because I was rotating, and I stabbed down, but somehow I was moving... Oh, that's cool. You can actually move while you're stabbing. At least while you're stabbing down. I did not think that was gonna... gonna... Yeah, I did not expect that. Um... Yeah, I'm just gonna use the double green herb right now. Blocked, of course. Gold crest. We need a silver crest and we need a gold crest, so we're definitely coming back here, so we might as well clear the room. Alright, so. Again, guessing the steering wheel's gonna come in handy. So, shall we. Go back upstairs, drop some things off. Get some more healing items, because God knows I'll need it. And we'll be on our way back down to that, uh... Not really a puzzle that I couldn't figure out. <laughs> God, it's just the... The hex crank puzzle. Of all things that I couldn't figure out. Ugh, oh, I'm disgusted with myself. <laughs> Except I'm assuming it's the steering wheel. I mean, I looked at the thing, and I'm like, Oh, octagonal shaped. They must mean the, the, the navy crest that I have. Not that it's a hexagon or anything. I can count shapes. Yeah! Help me! Steve? Why, are you, why do you sound like a little girl? Where are you? Uh, bathroom? Maybe? No. 
Nope. The hall? Those are the only two places we've opened, so it must be. I should probably get a pistol. Knife's probably not going to do much. Oh, oh, okay. He's in the, uh... I can hear the alarm. <laughs> oh, Steve. You are quite the dumb guy, aren't you? Come on, I figured out what you're supposed to do in, like, five seconds. Come on, Steve. Ah, okay. So there's a message on the control panel. When two pairs complete, my anger will subside. What? Okay. Operate it. Um, no, but Steve is suffering. Alright, combat knives. I'm guessing we want to look at these handguns. Model fighter plane. Okay, I'm trying to figure out if there's a. Uh, and magnums. Okay, uh. Yeah, let's, let's operate it. Uh, I'm guessing C and E, because they're both pistols. Yeah? Good, okay, cool. I made it. That was too close. What took you so long? Wasn't sure what I was supposed to do. Give them to me. <laughs> God, they're unloaded, bang. Fine. But let's make a deal. I'll trade you for something fully automatic. Hmm, let me think about your proposition. I have three guns and a knife. I'll see you around, Claire. Give me the damn gun, Steve. Adios. Hey, wait, Steve! <laughs> you are such a dumb kid. They aren't even loaded. And besides that... You're not even going to find ammo for them. Well, actually, no. If a person has a room like this, maybe you might find ammo for them. I don't know. Oh. <laughs> I do kind of like Steve, though. He is growing on me. But God, I should have just left him in there. <laughs> what took you so long? I wasn't sure what they wanted me to pair. I wasn't sure if you wanted the... Oh? Hello? Redfield! How dare you interfere with my operation? What are you talking about? You let yourself be captured so you could lead your people to this base. I have no idea what you're babbling about. You don't fool me. I am Alfred Ashford, commander of this base. Oh? <laughs> you must be one of Umbrella's lower level officers if you're in command of a backwater base like this one. How dare you! <laughs> the Ashford family is among the world's first and finest. My grandfather is one of the original founders of Umbrella Inc. Oh, I like this guy. Now tell me, why have you attacked this installation? Attacked? Shortly after you arrived, my base was attacked. You must have informed your people of its location. So what do you mean, I my people? Are you afraid of a you. bunch really of motorcycle racers? Come on. Unacceptable! How can you deny it? My base has been destroyed. And thanks to you, the experimental T-Virus was released, creating countless zombies and monsters. Yeah, I... I... Tell me. Who do you work for? I totally wasn't in prison while that happened. <laughs> Have it your way, then. You're just a rat in a cage anyway. I'll be sure to keep you entertained before I dispose of you. <laughs> oh, I like this. It's like the deadliest game mixed with just eccentric bad guy. 
which is always fun. <laughs> Alfred Ashford, also the not one, not much for for alliteration in names, but man, if his voice isn't something, <laughs> ah. That voice! Oh my gosh. Okay. Maybe Claire is actually working for someone. Maybe she took on the role of Ada Wong. Hmm? Hmm? Did we check this stuff? I think there were just pist was just pistol ammo here. Yeah. Uh, hmm? Hmm? I don't know. I'm, I'm still gonna leave that crossbow ammo because I don't have the room for it. Oh yeah. Let's put this let's put this baby out to sea. <laughs> the I mean to go with with the eccentric billionaire, the most eccentric way to raise a submarine. Well, okay. I'm out of here. Time to blow this popsicle stand. <laughs> I'm not going to stay here. I get a submarine gonna get off this crazy island uh, not yet let's let's make sure that okay there's no zombies ooh yes indeed I want to equip that side pack thank you all right so hmm can we come back here if I do this? Let's find out, shall we? I feel like this game is one of those ones where it doesn't like you to go back. So. Alright. Getting off this crazy island. It's like if Gilligan ever let if Gilligan ever ended. <laughs> Please don't just be a bathosphere and just bring me down into a crazy underwater city. You're just a bathosphere, and you brought me down into a crazy underwater city or lab. Great. I mean, it is called Biohazard, isn't it? So, I mean, Bioshock, Biohazard? <laughs> uh, that's not clever at all. It looks cool, though. <laughs> Alrighty. So, I'm guessing this is the lab of some sort. I, oh! Because there's always a lab, you know? Zombies making out. Other fun stuff. Looking like Nazis. <laughs> fun stuff all around. Should probably have taken that, uh... that crossbow ammo. These guys are a lot weaker, too. Which is nice. Means I can save some ammo. No, no, no. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> that was not a good thing. Uh, I keep forgetting they added the knife bouncing off in two. Uh. No! If I die to this one zombie... <laughs> okay. Okay. I, I saved my dignity, at least. Okay. Oh. Thought I was all set. Jeez. I have to nibble on my ankles. Alright, so. Are we going to be having to pass through metal detectors again? I saw those in Griffins, don't worry. I'm just wondering because of the baggage. I don't like the look of that right now, but 
Uh, what can we do? What are you looking at, Claire? Come on, tell me. Something over there? No? Okay. Fine enough. Let's go back. Because I want to pick up those ink ribbons and I want to end the episode. Okay, so let's see what else is in this this main area. Ooh, fish. <laughs> I mean, we're underwater, so it only makes sense that they'd have an aquarium. Uh, it's kind of like having a, a, a pool inside your pool. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, let's see what's in this main area. Or I'm guessing it's more of a main area. Bats? So no running. No loud noises in general. That's cool. Uh. Oh, okay. It's like a a military a military uh, cargo plane. Boarding lift. This is gonna be a bad thing. All those bats are gonna freak out, aren't they? Yup. Yup. Who guessed it? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Uh, I should probably heal, actually. That's probably the best idea. Let's get out of here. Actually, probably get out of here to the plane. Apparently. Apparently. It won't work. Oh, I need three crests, I'm guessing. Probably a wolf, a unicorn, and a falcon or hawk or something like that. Actually, wait, no, we found the Navy Crest. So, Navy, Army, Air Force. Is that what, what it's gonna be? Okay, don't show me the map of the island. That's cool, too. You know, I'd like a little orientation of how things are going, but... Oh, I'm guessing we have to raise this in order to get the plane out, so we're going to have to find some way around after we get all the crests, because there's probably going to be a control panel on this side. Okay, okay, no, I see how this is going. Game just wants to screw around with me. K402, no idea what that means. Uh... And then a giant claw came from above, snatched up Claire, and she was crushed. Oh, I see what has to go happen. Uh, I see what has to happen. <laughs> I can words. Cool, it's like a mini game. Hello, anybody up here? No, it's all me. Cool means I can take as long as I want, screw around as much as I want. Yeah, I'm gonna move the lever. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Talk about intense. No, that oh no. Oh shoot. Because there was something on the ground floor. But I think I can't get any more. Well maybe I can. It doesn't look like it's a warning sign is visible. The lift may not operate if power levels are low. Power levels? Well, power levels are fine enough, so. <laughs> oh god, the loading crew! Whoa, whoa, whoa. No, that is the worst possible place for you to go, Claire. No! <laughs> oh god, this is terrible. I got caught on that one little pylon, and... Oh god. That was terrible. 
Oh. Claire, Claire, Claire. What are we gonna do with you? Oh, that's zombies. Dumber than a sack of bricks. Look like most of them are. So, that's good at least. Alright, let's take out Lando Calrissian clone number 3954. Oh, well, because he, he does look just like the, the original guy that we met. Oh no, he's getting back up. God damn. These guys are resilient. And... Come on! Yeah, there we go. Oh no! They've gotten smarter! They've learned the patterns! They're learning machines! That's their true horror! I forgot to equip the, <laughs> equip the pistol. Oh shoot, they're running now. I, I mean, they, they were kind of running before, but... That was quite ways away I was. So... Looks like we're all set, though. No more music, so I'm guessing they're gone for good. Ah, oh, jeez, Claire. Can't believe you. Running into a wall like I told you to. <laughs> Biohazard card? Don't you mean the Resident Evil card? That's right. I read the Wikipedia page for the first game. <laughs> a card sh key shining in silver. Ah, I can use this at the military training facility. I guess we are done here for now. Uh, oh wait, there's a door I did not check that is above us. Oh wait, wait, wait. Can I, uh, do I want to put the lift down first? I think I do. No, it's not working. Okay, that's cool. That's good too. I guess. I don't think we really need it. So, eh, whatever. What is through here? Oh, this is, yeah, this is the puzzle part. <laughs> Except the control lever is missing. I mean... Alfred is saying that we destroyed his base, but, I mean, honestly, Alfred, your base was kind of in a shitty state to begin with. I think you should be looking for incompetence in your own men. You know, misplacing levers, the wheels to actually, like, get the bathysphere up. Stuff like that, before you pointing, start pointing the fingers at random people. I mean, I'm not trying to tell you how to do your job, but... That's... Learn how to do your job as a commander. <laughs> Alright. So, we're gonna go back up, and I'm gonna see you guys next time on a very special episode of Let's Blindly Play Resident Evil Code Veronica with me, Fu. We're gonna go back to the military training facility, which I guess that's what it is, because that's what the card said. Key card. I don't remember any time that we needed a key card. Anyway, we're gonna go back there. And... See what we can do, because I can't think of anything else we can do down here. Except, you know, use the... The Navy Crest, but we, we can always wait for that. Alright, I'll see you guys next time. Take it easy.